The inspiration behind the legacy was uh, just to create something fun, explosive, and captivating for the My Road Reel film competition. Um, we don't really fit their criteria in regards to any of the other um, genres because ours is quite action heavy. We're, we're, we're stunt people, we've got to do something with action, right? Uh, so we needed to put a little bit of the drama in between the rounds. When Alana and I sat down to write it, uh, we pretty much wrote the first draft in the first nights. We took it to Grant and he's like, okay, that's like three pages too long. <laughs> Um, it was very John Wickish to start with, and we streamed like lined it back to just purely a title fight. The editing process for a fight scene is quite different to a standard scene. Everything's so erratic. When you watch the, the completed film, you'll notice that there's very few cuts that last longer than a second or two. And, and the whole idea of that is to almost create chaos, not confusion. You know, making sure the the impacts are really hard. And that's a hard thing to achieve on set because you're trying to create something real, but at the same time, safe. Okay, the story was basically centered around this fight. Uh, it's the championship fight. Everything's at stake in regards to her, or our father, because I play her brother in this, is, uh, is quite sick. And she's fighting for the world championship, which is a family legacy, because our father was never able to get to that point. So this is to try and prove to him, prove to all the naysayers that she's got what it takes to, to win that, 100%. Filming with both TV was a really good experience. They were so, um, they were so onto it. The whole team was really nice. Um, so I think Jilted Films and both TV were a great collaboration for this production. Both of the girls pushed it to the absolute limits. I could not be more proud of them as their performers, uh, as well as the entire cast and crew, like everyone involved in this just made the night so seamless. It was amazing. Working side by side with Ange was amazing. She was so dedicated um, to put in time for the rehearsals. I loved her energy. She was like really excited and like, thank you so much for having me on board this project which is amazing. We'd asked a few other stunties, but they weren't able to do it. And I feel like we just naturally found the right person for the role. On the day, we shot with uh, a red 8K cinema camera and a Sony FS5. We used um, a sound device, a 664 mixer, along with three Rode lapels. Uh, we used a Rode NTG4. We used a Rode boom pole. Uh, everything was Rode. <laughs>